the Tombs of a Mascot, a place that gives many great rewards. However, I plan to get them all. I want to get all the loot that I can get. I want to get all the transmux that I can get. And I will be out of here without a scratch. At least that is the plan. These bosses are all very intimidating and they have their own way of killing you. But I will master them. And this video I will show you just that. Or will I? My name is Mutz, and I will attempt to complete all of the common achievements in RuneScape. On my heart, cry, man. In the last video, I achieved the Arca Pet Transmog to get rid of the task, I can't do it. And we also did the level 500 TOA for the Fang Kit and the Grandmaster task as well. If you have not seen that video yet, I will link it in the description. Uh, in the last video, I forgot to beg for likes and subs at all in the whole video. So I guess you guys have to make up for it on this one. Seeing the channel grow does motivate me a lot. <laughs> but I guess now, I mean, there's just a few things to, um, to finish off at TOA. There's not like... I think I've done the dangerous things now. The most dangerous things I've done at TOA. So I think the rest should be sail like smooth sailing. If you thought a level 500 rate was bad, well, think again, because I'm here to present to you perfection of het. This task is officially the worst task that TOA offers. And I, I really mean it. This, is, <laughs> this task took me like multiple days and I don't know how many hours. Probably like 10, more than, probably more than 10. Basically, you need to be perfect in both the puzzle room and the boss fight room. However, all the invocations have to be on and you cannot do this in a solo. You have to be in a duo or more. Now, doing even more than a duo would not be recommended as you have the double specials at all times, meaning you're going to have a lot of orbs in the middle if you're going to do it with like five people or whatever. So duo is definitely the way to go. However, I decided it might be a good idea to do it in a solo duo form. So dolo, I guess, by just having someone scale up the raid to a duo and I just do the room myself, which means the fight will take very long. If you fill the task, you need to restart. However, I need to leave the whole raid. Unlike Sync. Okay, because it specced us. All right, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I'm just going to die here then. <laughs> All right, I'm ready. <clears throat> and this is exactly why this takes a lot longer for Hard Karaiman as I can just die to reset the room. I have to teleport all the way out. That was perfect, I just didn't shift click. There's a couple of different ways how you can mess up this task. One of them would be to tank a hit off prayer. Another would be to attack Arka with the wrong attack style. Or tanking a special attack. If you're doing this in a duo, neither of you can mess it up. I will try to show as many of the fills as I can in a very short time. Let's see how this goes. Oh, 
Just come face now. <clears throat> I don't want to talk about it. But during that for a bit, are you, are you, can you do the thing? The thing where you go around the sites can try. All right, let's try Jira. Maybe that'll work out for us. The person I'm Juroing with right now is actually Mr. Praceford. This is his alt, and he decided to help me out with this task. When I mentioned the thing, this is what I meant. The other person walks around the sides, dodging special attacks. This requires some precise timing. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I was looking at Pricefoot. <laughs> oh, no. Dude. No. Oh. And Yes, dude. Let's go. Let's go. Yes, man. Oh, that's so good. Shout out to Praceford. Shout out to Praceford. Oh, it's so nice to get done. Shout out to Praceford, helping you catch up to him. Yeah, legit. So true. Next up is the baby. I'm the boss. For this task, you have to have all of the boss invocations enabled. Since this includes Arca, it's very smart to do this in a solo. The lowest possible rate level for this task would be 310. This means you only have all the boss tasks enabled and nothing else. I, however, also enabled Walk the Path because I was kind of hoping that Arca would level up to level 2, so I would have a little bit more time on, on the Simon Sess. Going into this task, I didn't really think it was going to be very difficult, because I've basically done everything with all invocations on already, just separately, not all in one raid. The only thing I had never done before, at least not solo, is the medic invocation. Yeah, I I didn't really know what to expect. I thought it would be okay-ish, but uh, <laughs> it was kind of painful. <laughs> that was crap. <laughs> And that's why I robbed this many restores. <laughs> uh, man, screw this game. It didn't even level up Arca once. 
That is such bullshit. The only reason why I had Walk the Path enabled is so I could get a level 2 Arca. It didn't level up a single time. Oh, that is very frustrating. So, for those who don't know why I want a level 2 Arca, I'm not going to have much time to get to the middle. I'm not going to have much time to get to the middle with, um, with four memories. And I'm going to have double trouble enabled as well. So, I ideally want to have an extra memory so I have a little bit more time. But that's not going to be the case now. Luckily, the perfection of head took me two days, so I had a lot of Arca practice. So, it was no issue for me at all. I already did Barba at level 500 with all invocations on, so level 360 should be no issue. Just have to be careful to mind the gap. I did it! Now I just need to do Wardens, and we should be good! Go, baby. Maybe I'm the boss. Completed all the boss invocations. There we go. That's awesome. The medic was terrible, though. I do not like medic at all. <laughs> Never doing that again. We've got a purple on that as well. Ah, we don't. Next up is perfection of Scabros. We need to complete perfect Scabros and perfect Catherine in the same raid. This one was surprisingly easy. Just don't take unnecessary damage and prevent the eggs from hatching. And that is basically Ooh. it. Alright, a chill task done. Now it's time for another terrible task. Oh man, dude. Oh, this task, dude. I could literally make a full video purely on this task with the amount of footage that I have. I'm gonna do you guys a favor and only show a couple of the fails because. Oh my god, my whole directory is full of clips of this room. <laughs> it's so bad. This task requires all the Barba invocations to be on, and you can basically not take unnecessary damage, miss any specials, or whatever. This task will fill if you make a mistake, or if your teammate makes a mistake. On top of that, the puzzle room has to be sub 3 minutes. Alright, two people apparently is a bit rough. <laughs> There's no way. There is no way we missed it by a tick. We missed it by a tick. One tick. Oh. Surely that's it. Alright, we decided. <clears throat> We're getting a fourth. Mr. Praise Food. The Hardcore of GM. Okay! Finally, we made it past the puzzle room. Okay. <laughs> okay. About time. About time. Part one of the whole CA. Now, surely we won and done this thing. Alright. No boulders tanking. Kill the baboons as soon as possible. Um, I don't want to die. So I'm not going through the middle. Oh! I think we just... We just don't skip it. Safest option. <laughs> okay. Alright. All right. New rule. No, new rule. <laughs> no skipping at boulders. <laughs> Let's go. This time we'll get it for sure. <laughs> Bro, I can make a whole YouTube video purely on this room. <laughs> think, well, we got the time. <laughs> that was not the that was not the the hard part, I guess. Though well, that was kind of the hard part, but now we just don't troll. <laughs> okay, I used a bit of supplies here actually, but it's okay. I don't think I need this many brews. Wait, Krogan, we did. <laughs> We both did not realize. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> we, were, we were both just standing there. We're like, where are our teammates, man? <laughs> where are our teammates? They just left because they knew that we've already messed up. <laughs> I mean, Saz definitely knew. Saz definitely knew that we messed up, but.
when the gap is on. Why not move that way? Oh. <laughs> My phrase. Got a reset? Does not matter. Wait. It didn't fill. I don't know. <laughs> that was scary. Yeah, I collect that tab a lot of times. Looking back at this clip, I was actually two tiles away from getting thrown into the gap. So that was extremely scary. Yeah, I don't want to risk that. That's why we don't red X. Attempt number 73 or something. Yes! One and done, baby. <laughs> First try. First try, we got it, man. That was so sick. Holy shit. Yo, shout out to my team. First trying this task. Actually insane. TOA has a lot of mechanically challenging tasks. However, this one is probably considered to be the most difficult one. I am, of course, talking about All Praise Zabak. This task requires you to do a level 4 Zabak. An expert level. But there is a catch. You cannot lose a single prayer point throughout the whole fight. Meaning you have to flick your prayers at all times. Okay. I don't mind. I mean that was really good, but like I made a lot of progress on this kill because I discovered a lot of things. Which I probably should have discovered a lot sooner, but I am using my alt once again to practice. I would show all my deaths, but uh <laughs> I think I'm just gonna show the death count. Yeah, 27 in this session. <laughs> and now I brought new gear switches, actually. Um, which will be a lot nicer to do the room with. 21 prayer bonus compared to what I was running. It was probably like 7 or something. So not that much. This is a big difference. This means like the fractions of prayer loss before it actually is a prayer point is so much better. So I can basically not really miss flicks, but kind of, I guess, not flick perfectly all the time and be fine, which is going to be helpful for the end. So once it starts doing mega fast attacks, that's when I want to use this and probably lose some prayer points. Well, not lose a prayer point, lose fractions of, prayer point, of a prayer point. It's a bit, bit difficult to explain, I guess. If you're not a hard cry man and you fill this task by losing a prayer point, you can simply just die and restart the room and try again. However, obviously, as a hardcore, I cannot do that. Every time I fill up a task, I have to teleport out. But you have to consider that the back has to be level 4. You cannot enter TOA with the back being level 4. You have to first do another room and then hope that the back levels up. This is why I was very scared to do this task because I knew it could take a very long time if I had to keep resetting. A little bit of teleport practice doesn't hurt. Oh, the teleport was insane. Oh, I should have teleported a lot sooner, I guess, technically. But... This task starts to become difficult when the back reaches low HP. This means his attack speed will increase and whenever the blood spawns will be spawning, the tomatoes, uh, this is where you have to move around the room while getting your flicks right. What helps out a lot here is if you have auto retaliate on, which means you don't have to click back on the back, you just have to make sure you're dodging the tomatoes. I discovered that being in this last phase, you have to flick an attack every two ticks. 
This is very useful because that meant I have one tick spare in between where I can move around. Also, camping either the north side or the south side, the back has the chance to spawn the tomatoes on the opposite side of you, meaning they will not see you and they will actually wander around like this. Nice, dude! That was clean! That was hella clean! Okay. That was really good. That was that was unpotted as well. That was unpotted, but that was really like that was flawlessly executed right there. Sweet. I think we're ready. Oh. All right. It did level up. Let's do this. One and done, baby. One and done. One and done. Combat task complete. One and done, baby. That was really good. Really good switching between the eating and the prayer flicking. Really happy with that. Really, really happy with that. Another task done. And then there were three. However, it's basically two. <laughs> because for some reason, these tasks overlap each other. If you complete the sub-18, you will complete the other one. I still have a few transmogs to go, so we're going to go for the Warden transmog on this run. The requirements for this are level 450 raid, all the invocations for Warden on, and you cannot die, which I hopefully won't. I've never had it go- oh, dude, I was like, bro, where the hell is it? Dude, I, I have never had it go there. I, I, I've never had to do that many hits to kill it. I was like, bro, where, where did it go? I couldn't find it. <laughs> I have never in all my TOAs had it go there. Because, like, you don't usually need that many hits to kill it.
Holy. 10 HP. All right, let's break that down because that was very close. Basically what happens, Akka starts to summon Cess. I make my way towards the middle and everything looks fine. I'm at 112 HP. Look at that, I'm at 112 HP, but I'm expecting the proc to be a lot sooner. But I forgot that I turned off Phoenix Special, which means the Simon Test is very slow compared to what I'm used to. So I click preemptively, tank the Quadrant, tank an Orb. I even get a Brew in in between. And I'm at 10 HP when I teleport out. If I stayed one tick longer, I would have died. Also, if I didn't get the Brew sip in, in between, I would have also died. As crazy as it sounds, I don't think I could have died here if everything maxed on me, because everything was already close to maxing on me. Hmm, didn't have to tell you, but I didn't like that. Should have just tanked it. me out. Holy, that was a big lag. I'm glad I'm not at a warden when that happens, I guess, because that would have been really bad. a very good ambrosia i noticed i was getting hit by the boulders i the next tick i instantly ambrosiaed i knew i was gonna tank that okay there we go warden transmog well we also get a purple with it though no pretty good purple chance on this but no sadly not collection log slot yeah baby oh, look at that Ancient Remnant. Bam! Dude, this, looks, this, looks, this one looks kind of sick, dude. This is flying. Look at him. It's just flying. <laughs> and then get this one. This one is also just flying. <laughs> and then they're not the same ones. It's a different head, bro. Yay! <laughs> and with that, there is only one transmog left to get, and that is the Kefri transmog. Uh, it leveled up. Nice. That means we can just go straight into Kefri. I've done plenty of Kefri level 4s, by the way. I just never done it with Medic. <laughs> Luckily, I'm not the one shooting them. <laughs> Shout out to Finish Flash for running some duos with me. He is a very talented gamer, and uh, yeah, he never dies in the raid. <laughs> I think that was doomed anyway. I'm pretty sure that was doomed anyway, with how much space we had left at that point, and we still had to proc the major. I think that was doomed no matter what, so it's probably good that he died. Uh, we reset those, I guess, or we go up Meekin, I don't know. We could go up Meekin, I guess. Hmm. I was not ready for that. Flash out of food. There's not, we're not gonna make this. We need way more space. 
I guess I use the ranger space too. I can milk a lot on that side. Nice. Uh, I guess we go carefree now. Yes. I swear it was level four, bro. I swear I saw level four. I swear to God, I saw level four. I don't know. I was a little bit weirded out by the fact that Arkham was level five. I'm like, oh, that's weird. <laughs> Yeah, this is a telly, we're not making that. <laughs> Holy. Okay, we cleared it. Uh, we need to hurry up though. Yeah, uh, we're not gonna make it, probably. Fine, we got a purple here, surely. Damn. It's okay, we got a purple. It's okay. It's not even purple, dude. Uh, that sucks. So we made the... We made the Kefri thing, but uh, we didn't get a per we didn't get a time, so it went down. We didn't end up getting it. Kind of sucks. Holy teleport! Holy teleport! Holy teleport! Right there. That was a lot closer to death than I initially thought it was. So first of all, I actually wasn't sure which quadrant to stand on at the start, so it was already a bit messy. But there was a good reason why both me and Flash both missed the first detonation. I only realized this when I was looking back at the clip, but if you pay close attention to the last uh, light up on the lightning, it actually was delayed which made the detonation come one tick after straight away. On top of that, I actually also walked into the wrong quadrant at the moment I teleported, so I would have died to the next detonation if I had not tallied. I'm sitting at 31 HP here, being in the wrong quadrant. Level 450, solo carefree. Medic was terrible though. I do not like Medic at all. <laughs> Never doing that again. Yes, dude! Let's go! Oh, I was gaming at the end, man. I was really gaming at the end. Let's go, man. Oh! Oh! Let's go! <laughs> 13 minutes and 46 seconds. I was messing up so much on the second one, on the second shield. I was messing up so much. I kept missing this one. I kept missing the back one. Just very annoying. Um. 
Wow. Really? I live though, at least, but... <laughs> dude, that's so stupid. I dropped frames, dude. Oh my god. Really, bro? Well, at least I'm alive. You know, that's what matters most, but... It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. What? <laughs> huh? <laughs> huh? Bro! How did it go there? <laughs> that was that was the most unfortunate happening right there. I, <laughs> I like slipped in as well. Alright, we're gonna do a duo. Should be a lot smoother. I know I can do it solo, but I'm gonna do a duo with Kriskis. Should be a one and done now. Kriskis is a medic enthusiast, you know? He loves it. Yeah, we did it. I know this is so much easier in a duo. <laughs> so much easier. Oh. I say in a Jira, but with Krisky's it's so much easier. Because Krisky just does this for fun, you know? <laughs> nice. Alright. Let's go. The last transmog on the hardcore. Do we also get a purple with it though? Because. We've not had a purple in any of our transmogs. No! Dude, none of my transmogs had a purple. Neither did my fan kit. None of mine have had a purple on them. Also, none of my CA tasks have had any purples on them. That, that's so unlucky. I don't know why. Collection log slots. Oh. Don't Bro, why did I get... I got surprised by it. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, I got something! I <laughs> Let's go! Why am I checking the leaderboard? I don't know. I did more damage than Chris Keys. I mean, that makes sense because he didn't do any damage on Kepri pretty much. And bam, look at that. All the transmogs unlocked. Oh, look at that. Look at his poop rolling bug. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. If I do this, if I do this, like go Barbie and then go to Kethriti, and then it should be running. No? Wait, did I fix that? Wait. I need to pick it up. Pick it up, drop it. Now it should be running. Yes, and now we go to Kethriti. We have a running poop now. Running poop! Yeah, it's sprinting! <laughs> it's sprinting! <laughs> there, look at this! We're almost done now. All we need is a Missouri buddy. It's time for the most difficult task TOA offers, the eight man speedrun. This task is extremely difficult because you have to organize a team of eight people who all have insanely good gear, preferably even max gear. Even I as a content creator was struggling to get a team together. And I know a lot of people and a lot of people know me. So I'm in a very privileged position. This task can be dangerous because it, things get very messy because people prioritize DPS and people are just running around like crazy. <laughs> Aka is by far the scariest one out of all the bosses. It has a special attack which is the detonation. If you don't DD, you can basically get one shot. This is exactly why I'm isolating myself from the rest as much as I can. With this task, it's all about organization and not missing DPS. So make sure you're always DPSing when you're able to, making use of the red carry spec, which you see me use in this clip. Um, it, it makes my teammates hit bigger, basically. Since I don't have a ZCB, uh, I'm the best person to be doing this.
Okay, well, we, right. We still got the other one. Um, For a first try, that went very well. I was so madly focused, though. Holy shit. That's so weird to get the back chest. <laughs> Alright, I'm now I'm officially two tasks away from TOA GMs. HK loot. Holy shit. No! Praise died. I thought it was mods? No. I don't think we get this now, right? Oh, we're not done yet. <laughs> Wait, I'm f trolling. None of these raids are purple. Oh, shit! No way! <laughs> no way! <laughs> no way! Caught one gets the pet! So deserved! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh, it's done that yet? Yeah, I don't know what I was doing. I was turning out, I guess, but like. So at this point, I was struggling to get a team because people had to go and it's very difficult to get eight people together at all times for multiple runs. But then Mr. Lucid Dream came to my chat and he's like, oh, do you still need the eight man task? And I'm like, yeah, I do. Now I'm going to be completely transparent here. Um, basically, these guys carry people daily and they have a discord for it and they basically offered me to take me on for free, usually have to pay for these. Um, and this is the only task that I would really consider this being very worth for. Because getting a team of eight people together, even as a content creator, is difficult. And, and if you are not a content creator, there is almost no other way to do this task. Where you need like some very cracked friends. They also offer to do other CAs, um, but I will most likely not take that offer because uh, I think I'll be fine on everything else. Alright. Mage. Congrats. Hell yeah, let's go. Thank you guys. Congrats, dude. Massive. So yeah, this is the last time. <laughs> why is it this? Why is this task the last one, man? Why? <laughs> I did not expect to struggle with ta this task whatsoever, man. I'm struggling, bro. All right, time for perfect wardens on expert level. Let's do it. That is pretty much it. It's perfect wardens, but on expert level. So that means you cannot take unnecessary damage. So you cannot take damage from lightning. You cannot take damage from an auto attack or prayer. Not damage by the floor cycles, etc., etc. Now the annoyance of this task is that you have to go through the whole raid to even attempt this task. Um, so that is a downside. The plus side is that you're getting KC. So you have potential to see purples on this, um, which is nice. Oops, I was trolling a bit there. But what I've noticed is that it's very easy to just zone out, make a mistake. Um, it happens so quickly. No! Oh, shit! Oh, I'm so sorry. I... Bro, I was just fully zoned out.
Okay. And a bit of brain lag there. No! I'm so sorry, man. I didn't see it. I literally didn't see that one. Could have moved. No! Dude, I noticed as soon as I clicked the boss, man. I noticed it. Ah. The good thing about this task, though, I've said this before, but the good thing is that I'm actually getting kill count. That's pretty massive. So I've got the things out. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> 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 I got on you still. <laughs> yeah, I'm TP. Ah, Sammage. I saw it happening too. I was like looking at it, like, is he gonna touch his prayer? <laughs> I didn't see it. I think I was over my prayer room. Unfortunate. Is there a boulder there? Excuse me? That was all the way over there! How did that happen? I almost messed that up myself. No! That's so close, dude. We were not hitting anything, man. We were literally not hitting anything. We were... Uh, uh. I just want to get this task done, man. I did not expect... When I, like... When I went for all the TOA tasks, I was, like, not worried about this task whatsoever, man. And But it's, and it seems it's taking quite a lot of attempts. Probably the most attempts out of all my tasks are here, currently. Free transmog. Yep, I did. Uh. Let's go! We got it! Every TLA task completed. Shout out Saz. For the one and done, obviously. <laughs> that took me so long, this task. All we have left now is a Missouri body to get. And then we're completely done with TLA. All of the CAs are done at least. Do I get a purple as well here? Ah, oh, that would have been so good. Imagine. Imagine if we completed both in the same raid. That would have been so sick. It's literally just farming purples now. Imagine leeching the raid sass. SMH, dude. We also got a PB. Huh. Alright. I didn't get a single purple. I didn't get a single purple on my CAs for TOA. I didn't even see a purple for anyone on any of my CA runs. 
RCA attempts even. <laughs> That's weird, isn't it? Not a single purple in any of the CAs. I'll say none of, none of my uh, transmogs and shit also do not have a, um, a purple on them. Time for purples. It would be nice to get a purple straight away after completing the CAs. That would be perfect. Purple. Uh, game is a scam, actually. We're sending 400s now with Mr. VIP. Red number six should be on drop rate. Let's see it. Yes, it's for VIP. Let's go. It won't be a Missouri body, right? Right? All right. Wait, let's get another one. A back to back. Oh, it's wait, it's it's for VIP again. No way, not a body. As long as it's not a body, we're not we're not salty. Shadow, come on, shadow, <laughs> be a shadow. Okay, well that that kind of sucks actually. <laughs> what the hell? Good luck. Four twenty kill count. Sure, yeah, is it? Can I finish on 420? That would be sick, actually. Oh. Hey, it's actually mine. Oh, shit. Yo? Can I get the buddy? <laughs> Can I get the buddy? Come on. Surely. Ray! It's probably gonna be a ring, isn't it? Oh, a bang. We'll take it. Better than a ring. <laughs> All right, the back to back. Surely. Oh my God. Wait, is it for me again? It is. <laughs> no way. <laughs> no way. I got a. I got my first ever back to back. I think. I don't think I've had a back to back in TOA. Surely we can continue and go to next. I mean, we'll take it. Sure. <laughs> Money. <laughs> Uh, we're uh, on our way to uh, 15 fangs now, I think. <laughs> we're catching up. We're catching up a bit. We're catching up. Yeah. I got my brew that I dropped here at the front. <laughs> do we get a purple? Or do we not get a purple? Is it the last raid or is it not the last raid? It's not the last raid. No, oh, is it mine again? It's mine again. Holy shit. It's actually, dude, that's my third purple today. <laughs> what the hell? Dude, these 400s are paying off such big time. We got two fangs so far today. Good luck. Thank you, Mr. VIP. Finish it, baby. Purple number 31. Come on. Complete it for me. Please. <laughs> it's been a while. It's been a while. <laughs> Number 16, baby. Gotta keep the meme alive a bit, you know? Gotta keep the meme alive. <laughs> Alrighty. Surely a cheeky a purple. Hey yo. Hey yo, it's mine again. <laughs> Bro, I'm just printing them, man. I swear to God. <laughs> I'm just printing them. I'm literally printing purples. Surely we're done. Gimme. Give Gimme give the body. Ah, the cringe. Ah, that's, that hurts. Ah, ah, that hurts, man. That hurts. Are you clear? Yay. <laughs> Holy spin, <laughs> dude. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. A one mil suit chest. Finish it on. You may have got two times power, I see. Oh? It is actually mine too? Can we do it? I did say, can we finish on 444? Show it to me, baby. The Missouri buddy. Please. The Missouri buddy right here. Number what? Seventeen? 
Uh, yeah, 17. 17 lion bearers. The back to back, surely. Oh, hey, the back to back, but it's time for Saz. Can Saz perhaps finish it? Go on, he needs chaps, by the way. He needs chaps, I need body. So don't get a body, please, <laughs> don't do that. Oh, sad. Sad, dude, sad. No way. And it's mine? A back three back? <sighs> Pain. Not very clean. But, do we get a back four back? No. Oh boy. That's not great. All right, let's see. No. <laughs> you did not just do that. Okay. Um. <laughs> oh no. Uh, I will see if I can do this. We'll see. Just that easy. Solo Warden, 1 plus 1, 400. <laughs> Do we get rewarded for that? No, <laughs> of course not. Surely a purple for one of us. Hey, nice. It's mine. Okay. Are we done with TOA for good? Can be any purple from this point, so... Oh my god! I got it! Collection log slots? I got it! Completed. We're done! TOA is done! TOA is completed. Let's go. We are not dying at TOA. For all the people who doubted me, dude. Yes, I've had many close calls, but we're fully done. CA's done. Loot done. Transmog's done. Pet done. I've got everything but the capes. Uh -huh.